Hey guys, this is Bales, and I am going to show off our new My Lineups page. Um, and this is where you can view all of your saved lineups. So one of the new features of our lineup builder is you can save lineups. So you can optimize a lineup, save it, and it'll go to the My Lineups page. You can also generate multiple lineups based on your model. Um, so click Generate Lineups. We have 10. Uh, say we'll select all of them, save. And on the My Lineups page, we should have 11 new lineups um, that we can easily export to DraftKings, which I'll show you in the final video. On this page, we have um, the ability to sort by site, uh, slate. You can also look at the date so we can look at past lineups that we've created and see the scores on DraftKings. So just an easy way to look back at some of your past lineups. Um, by date. Uh, we also have the exposure. So this is the exposure that we have to every player in these 11 lineups. Um, flex usage. So 27% of our players who are in the utility spot are senders, 55% are shooting guards, and so on. Um, lineup alerts where you will get um, alerts on, on any players who are uh, in your lineups, um, specifically when they are out. And if you have our app, the Fantasy Labs app, which is on iOS and Android, um, you also will be able to get push notifications when those players are out. Um, you can remove all of the lamps. You can remove them individually. Uh, you can also export to DraftKings. And um, so if you click that, you'll get an Excel file here. And in the next video, I'll show you exactly how to do that. But it's a really simple process. So we basically just created 11 lineups. Um, from here, we can export them to DraftKings in maybe 30 seconds or so. Uh, so really creating high-quality lineups, a large number if you prefer, and getting them into contests, contests very, very quickly. Um, I think it's a really big upgrade for the site, and I'm really excited for you guys to use it.